Smart and Special Teaching presents the suffixes T-I-O-N and S-I-O-N. Let's say shun. There are two ways to spell the sound shun. We can spell it T-I-O-N or S-I-O-N. Yes, if you look at the base word, it can usually help you decide how to spell it. If a base word ends in S, S-E, D, D-E, or M-I-T, it becomes S-I-O-N, shun. If the base word ends in any other consonant or other silent E combination, we use T-I-O-N. Many times, if you look at the base word, you can see how to spell the word. If you look at this word here, the base word is instruct. Instruct is spelled I-N-S-T-R-U-C-T. Instruct means to teach, and it is a verb. If I add on the suffix I-O-N, it becomes a noun. Instruction. Look at this one. We have the verb reflect. The base word ends in a T, so we add the suffix I-O-N, and this verb becomes a noun. Reflection. Here's another verb, prevent. Prevent ends in a T. Now we add I-O-N and we get prevention. Here we have mention. The base word doesn't always end in a T. In this case, there isn't really a base word. It's just men and then the sound shen, mention. Here, we have a base word, tense. But when we add I-O-N, we need to take off the single silent E at the end of the word, and then it becomes tension. Here we have S-I-O-N as the ending. The base word televise becomes television. Televise ends in a silent E, but we take off that silent E when we're adding the suffix I-O-N. I-O-N is a vowel suffix. We're going to take off the silent E and add it to televise. Then it becomes television. Here we have the base word confuse. Confuse ends in a single silent E. When we add the suffix I-O-N, confuse becomes confusion. Here we have the word conclude. When a word ends in a D, it's too hard to say conclusion. So we change the D to an S, and it becomes conclusion. We take off the single silent E and change the D to an S, and then it becomes conclusion. The conclusion of something is when something ends. It concludes. Here we have explode. Again, it ends in a silent E. We take the silent E off, change the D to an S, and explode becomes explosion. Here we have divide. Again, 
and in a single silent E, we move the silent E, change the D to an S, and it becomes division. So let's practice reading words with T-I-O-N and S-I-O-N. That should be easy. That cake is a big temptation. She wants to watch television. He needs to see his reflection. What is she feeling? What emotion is she feeling? Do you know how to do division? The detective did an investigation. We went on vacation and had some relaxation. I hope this video has been helpful to you. If you need more resources for learning about T-I-O-N, and S-I-O-N, please come to my store, Smart and Special Teaching, where you'll find lots of resources on teaching reading and writing. Thank you.